Welcome back to the five minute reset. Today, I wanna to bless you guys by reading from I Hear His Whisper, which is one of the devotionals I wrote with Brian Simmons. And this particular one is very personal for me because, so some of you may not know this, I'll give you a little, a little uh, insider information. There are a handful of prophetic words in here that the Lord spoke to my heart over the years that were significantly powerful. They, they brought me into a, a shift in my relationship with him. And, you know, obviously prophetic words are usually very personal, but there was some that the Holy Spirit just highlighted and said, this is not just for you. I want you to bring this word that I spoke to you. Some of these words were years old. Um, and he asked me to include them in this book because they were not just for me. And this is one of them. You know, we all go through these seasons where it's like, we want so much to hear from God, but we realize that we're not hearing from God. Or we want to feel his presence, but we realize all we're feeling is stressed or consumed with the, the day's problems or the week's problems or whatever. And I was in that kind of season. Maybe you can relate. It was like, I love you, Lord, but I I don't even know what to do, and I don't know how do I hear you, and I was just like so in my head. Um, and, and so he spoke this to me. So before we get started, slow down right now. Get, sit somewhere comfortable. Take some slow, deep breaths, and turn your heart's attention to him. This is your time to feel his presence. This is your time to let go of whatever it is that's on your mind right now. It doesn't even mean that it's bad. Just let every thought go and focus in on his love for you. Feel his arms wrapped around you. You right now are in the presence of God. Right now, just as you're breathing, maybe you're not feeling especially spiritual right now or even at peace, but you are in the presence of God. Right now, you are. Because he's in you. If you're a believer, he is in you. And he said he would never leave you or forsake you. To stay here in this quiet place right now, as I read to you this um, devotion called Just Breathe. You don't have to strive to hear me or feel my presence. You aren't required to do anything. No conjuring emotions. No stressing about whether you've heard my voice. All you need to do is believe I'm with you. That's it. That's all I require for you to believe despite what you see or feel. To simply let go and exist in this moment with me. Be still. Know I'm right there with you, even if you don't feel me. I know how to move the hearts I've created. You were made for my love. You were created to know my voice. You are destined to see my face. Only don't try and push to make it happen. Lean back into my arms that are holding you right now, embracing you. Rest in this present moment with me. I am the center of everything. I am the truth that holds it all together. I am already with you currently exploding with love in the very center of your being. You don't need to do a thing. Just be. 
just breathe. And right here, as you stay here in the quiet and the stillness of his love, focusing on that beautiful, beautiful love, focusing maybe on your breath, I hope you will stay here a while longer and enjoy this moment with him. <laughs>